Meanwhile, Top America and Joe held a press conference today to promote the Greater Banda Business District. There was a notable absence at the event, Guo Shouzhen, chairman of Sinchuan Creative Park. The Taipei City government plans for Sinchuan Creative Park, Guanghua Digital Plaza, Zhengua Beer Factory, Huashan Culture and Creative Park, along with National Taipei University of Technology, to join together in a neighborhood development alliance. However, improper financial allegations levied at Sinchuan apparently led it to send a lower ranking official to the event. We are still undergoing negotiations. Of course, we hope that Sinchuan could assume the social responsibility that it owes to the area. Planning for the alliance went ahead. Another headache for Ke is the embattled Taipei Dome project. Far Glory Group took out a large ad claiming that Taipei Dome had already passed its safety inspection, even though the official report won't be released until April 16th. Why did he need to buy an ad? He can tell the construction and planning agency to endorse him. I think that technical problems need a technical solution. So far, Ke seems resigned to allow both the Taipei Dome and Sintren Creative Park to go forward as scheduled, despite previous concerns about safety and financial impropriety.